Hear me out. Why is it that when you about to straighten your hair, your curls look the best? Y'all know what I'm talking about. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then I just don't know what to tell you, honestly. Empty. I'm just sitting there stunned. Being a passenger princess as usual, okay? I'm trying to give y'all productive vibes. When I say I checked and clinked every crevice, I just got to swing and flip and whoop the doop before it started getting stiff. What am I, a construction worker? Good morning, y'all. So today is July. Let me not say June, because I know every time a new month comes, you're going to be stuck in the last month. Today, today today's actually the 4th. So today is 4th of July. As y'all can see, your girl got her hair blown out, okay? We actually about to flat iron my hair. Now, y'all, hear me out. I was like, you know what? Because I've been torn between so many styles that I want to do on my hair, right? I kind of wanted to straighten it. Then I kind of wanted to straighten it and put, like, a roller set in it so I could have, like, some cute little bounce curls i kind of wanted to like bouncy but loose if y'all get my drift because your girl hurt and grew out a little bit so you know i got a little lint to work with and then i was torn between doing a ponytail and i was also torn between doing locks so i'm thinking i'm about to straighten my hair now and then once i get tired of it being straight i'm gonna put a roller set in it or i might wine curl it i haven't decided yet and then once i get tired of the curls i'm gonna do a ponytail but y'all i have a real dope question why is it that uh, to my curly girls why is it that when you about to straighten your hair your curls look the best I, I just never understood it. I don't get it. But y'all know I had to push through and go ahead and uh, I had to push through and go ahead and blow dry anyway. What is that? College Hill. Is that drink? Have you ever seen this? College Hill? What is that about? Celebrity addiction. But yeah. So y'all let's go ahead and get into it. You girl got to straighten her hair. Hey y'all, what's up? What's poppin'? I wanna give a huge thank you to Busties for collabing with me on today's video. When I tell y'all, literally chef's kiss for my girls who lack in this area or for my girls who pack in this area, Busties tape is really, really amazing. I love it because no matter what size you are, it lifts you up. Let me go ahead and show y'all what they sent me. So the first thing I saw when I opened y'all was this tape. You kinda measure your length. All you do is cut it and you literally tape it from this end to this end and you're definitely gonna see a lift. And baby, let me just tell y'all your girl is loving it okay so that is literally one of my favorites i'm actually gonna be sad when i run out i'm actually gonna order some more i'm gonna show y'all the before and after the second thing that it comes with is these little sticky boobs y'all i love 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 sticky boobs baby handy handy these are literally my go-to's and then they also have more but these are in 10 and i think these are more like throwaway so maybe if you're going on like vacation or something so yeah once again i want to thank busty so much for clapping with me on today's portion of this video thank you guys so much and let's get back to the video <laughs> and also y'all let me show y'all what came in yesterday so y'all this is gonna be my desk for where i set my computer up but i'm actually gonna set up in that corner yeah so that actually ended up coming in yesterday hold on let me take y'all here oh baby this air has to go off oh y'all so your girl had to go put her robe on and i had to go put some sweats on because it is too cold okay oh you know what i just thought about y'all yesterday this outlet had went out i think because i had too much plug up in it let's hope it comes out Oh my gosh. Hold on, y'all. Y'all, so your girl is back at it. We in a new location. Okay, so I went ahead and blow my hair out last night, but your girl didn't flat iron it because, baby, I really didn't feel like it. Honestly, y'all, I waited till the last minute to blow it out. To be real, now we up and we about to flat iron it. And it's like 10, 12, so it should only take me like 45 minutes, maybe 30 minutes, honestly. It normally don't take me long. This is the heat protecting that your girl is using today. Y'all, I don't know what it is, but it seems like every time I flat iron my hair i feel like i need my ends trimmed like i'm gonna have to get them roots so baby okay prayer come on inches y'all so why last night me and joseph we was watching bel-air right y'all i've heard like a couple of things about this show like i've, I've heard that the show was good basically if y'all don't know what bel-air is it's basically like a remake of fresh prince of bel-air with will smith in it y'all know what i'm talking about if you don't know what i'm talking about then I just don't know what to tell you, honestly. That was before your time, but. So, it's basically like a remake of The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, and I had never seen no trailer or nothing. I just knew people was talking about it. Like, I knew I was hearing people talk about it. So I'm like, oh my gosh, you know what? So last night, 
I think he was trying to get on Crackle. I don't know. It's it's basically like Tubi. I don't know if y'all know what Tubi is. Or y'all might know what Crackle is. But I was asking him. I was like, have you ever watched stuff on Peacock? He was like, no. What's that? So I'm like, oh, Peacock is like this streaming service. I don't know if y'all know what Peacock is or y'all ever watched some on Peacock. But it's basically like a streaming service. So you can watch different shows, different movies. Now, Peacock used to be free all the way around. Now, I think that more people started to jump on the bandwagon. Now, they charge it. So they still do have a free version but i think it's limited to what you can watch i think like they'll let you watch so many seasons or so many episodes of a certain show and then they basically lock it until you have to upgrade to they have two of them they have 4.99 which you get to watch anything that they provide which is not bad because if you think about it i know netflix then went up on their prices they like honestly i don't know because i don't have netflix but peacock you can do 4.99 a month and you can watch basically whatever they offer they have tv shows movies everything the only thing is with the 4.99 one you you have ads but see me i never really too much cared about ads like they don't really bother me honestly because i know some people just cannot stand ads but i mean i never really cared about them like they never really bother me and so you can upgrade i think it's like 9.99 so you don't have to get ads but you know it's to each his own it's everybody's preference but yeah we was watching the first episode on there last night when i tell y'all it is good baby it's good to be honest i think i'm gonna watch it tonight again because baby it's good if y'all have never watched that tap in it's honestly good to me even though the only thing I feel like I feel like they could have been more spot on with some of the characters like okay Will the guy who played Will okay cool he didn't look exactly like him but he light skin kind of had the same type of cut Will had like I, I kind of got the visual that they was putting out you know but I feel like with Hillary I ain't even gonna say they could have did much better on Hillary because I love Coco Jones that much like that's my girl I love her I love all of her personality like she's just real real cool so honestly I did not mind the character being Coco Jones because I already knew her but I do feel like they could have found somebody who looked more like Hillary Banks. But at the same time, Coco got Hillary's attitude, like her personality to a T. But I feel like Uncle Phil, baby, they could have did better. They could have found somebody who looked like Uncle Phil. Like, baby, y'all should have had more casting calls, okay? Because I feel like, truth be told, they could have found somebody who looked like Uncle Phil. Like, somebody who bright skinned it, you know, on the bigger side. And the guy who played Carlton, he don't look nothing like Carlton. Like, I'm not trying to say, baby, y'all need to find a doppelganger, but at least some similarities where I'm like, ah, uh, like he do kind of favor him, you know? Like, I don't know if y'all ever seen, um, what's the name of the, uh, the show? I don't know if y'all ever seen Power, but Power had like different series to it. I think they had a Power, then they had a Power Book 2, Ghost. They got like different series of Power. So they had a series called Raising Kanan. The guy who played Kanan, which is 50 Cent, as a kid, he actually did favor 50 Cent. Like, I could see that being 50 Cent when he was a kid. It's all about the visual, I feel like. If y'all have seen that, let me know what y'all think. I feel like I'm just complaining about the show but i don't want to sound like that because the show was actually really good that's why i say like if you haven't seen it i definitely encourage you to go watch it because i literally could binge watch it like that's how good it is i'm excited because i'll be trying to find like more shows to watch to get into but i don't really be finding nothing that like you know i like like i know a lot of people talking about stranger things stranger things and i actually tried to get into stranger things a while ago y'all and i could not get into it and i remember i was at work one day i was at olive garden and i had this table these two ladies and they was talking about the show like probably has to be like in their 30s maybe early 40s you know i don't know they was talking about the show like they was telling me about it. they was like saying how they was hooked and i'm like man i'm gonna have to rewatch it because everybody keeps talking about it if ain't nothing popping off by the second episode i'm cutting it off i'm sorry baby i'm cutting it off baby she is straight okay baby she got some lint to her Y'all, so your girl is at Wally World. Hold on, let me cut this down, baby. We love you, Summer, but I cannot get copyrighted. So, yeah, I'm at Walmart. We at Wally World. Y'all, I finished my hair. I never did get on the cam and show y'all, though, but... Y'all, my hair is growing so freaking much. Like, the last time that I cut it, I literally tried to get all the dead hair off, but my stylist, she told me I ain't have no dead ends. So, yeah, but I think I am gonna do another big chop, y'all. Not right now. I don't know, probably, like, around fall, maybe, like, September. September, October-ish when it starts you know cooling down uh, maybe even November I don't know but I am gonna do a bigger chop because I want to get all this color off if y'all notice y'all probably can't see but I got like red on my hair like red on my ends and stuff so it's like a brown red and I think it came from like me dyeing my hair jet black so much but it's not gonna be like a big chop because I still want my hair to be a good length I just want to get all that color off so maybe like right here which is not really a big chop but that's like three four inches off baby I just like her to be black and that's it that's all I'm about to go in Walmart y'all because I feel like I'm always about to go in Walmart every time I vlog I feel like I'm always about to go in Walmart y'all so how about let me sit y'all up let me sit y'all up because baby i'm about to 
stretch out for a minute and get y'all story time. When I tell y'all, baby, I am tired and it's hot as piss. It is so hot. Oh my gosh, it is so hot out there. And not to mention your girl got on sweats, okay? How about I had to literally go to Walmart twice, y'all. I had to go two times, okay? I did insert, bruh, how is all my batteries dead? Okay, y'all, so we got two more batteries to spare and baby, let's hope they last. Anywho, like I was saying, I went to Walmart because we needed a couple things and y'all, it's more stuff that I still gotta get from Walmart. I just, it's so hot right now, y'all, that I literally cannot, like, and then, y'all, it was literally so freaking packed in Walmart, like, why was the self-checkout line, baby, I'm talking about, it was in the aisles, why was the self-checkout line in the aisles, and then, ever since self-checkout came about, they want to have two registers open, stink! I haven't even got to the icing on the top yet. Y'all finna be like, girl, when I tell y'all tea. How about I go to Walmart, the whole aisle of their shelves, empty. I took a video, so I'm finna insert it for y'all. Literally the whole aisle, like, so y'all, how about I literally did not, let me tell y'all how much of a rush I was in, first of all. For one, I didn't look at the Pico de Gallo when I picked it up. Like, I glanced at it from the side, but I didn't think to, like, look at the top and basically inspect it. I didn't think to do that because I'm like, you know, I've never really inspected my food like that. That's something that I'm going to start doing. I was in such a rush that when I went to, like, self-checkout, because mind y'all, I only had, like, a few items. Literally didn't have enough to even go through a line. So, I go to self-checkout. Why didn't I put the items in a bag? Like, y'all, I literally was scanning the items one by one and putting them back in the car. I get to the car, I'm like, why didn't I put this in bags? Get to the house, right? I'm taking everything in by hand because I didn't put nothing in the bag. I get inside and I'm about to start like building this desk or whatever, right? Joseph has started cooking some food. He was about to start putting the pico de gallo in the, um, in the guac. So he asked me, he like, what is this on the top? And I'm like, so I go over there, I'm looking and I'm like, Ew. Like, that's the first thing that came to my mind. Ew. Like, what is that? I'm like, oh my gosh, did I really get, like, molded food? So I'm like, oh my freaking gosh. Like, it's literally white stuff on the top. Oh, y'all, I wish I had took a picture. I didn't even think to take a picture with my phone. But it was literally white stuff all over the top of it. So I'm like, okay. At that rate, I'm like, okay, I'm finna go take this back to the store. I go to get a different one. Baby, why are all of them out of date? Like, literally all of them are expired. And I see, like, a thing of Pico de Gallo. I'm talking about it literally has mold all over it i'm like oh my gosh i'm just sitting there stunned so i'm like you know what not getting pico the guy from here just finna go return it get my money back whatever it's not adding up stink yeah didn't end up getting that but um right now y'all i am finna put this desk well i'm probably not gonna do it right this second but sometime today within like the next couple hours i am gonna um start working on this desk and then i need to go through my email because i need to sign one of these contracts Hey y'all, so um, first of all, let's talk about straight hair K. Okay, I need it, there we go, cause you're gonna need some better lighting. But straight hair K, she is in the building, being a passenger princess as usual. Okay y'all, so I haven't talked to y'all since yesterday, y'all. I literally, yesterday was the fourth. I had so much going on, I'm not gonna lie y'all. I did relax yesterday because I had a whole lot going on. Hold on y'all, hello, you still in the house? <laughs> Yeah, so I'm in the car. Me and Joseph, we about to go to Academy because I think he want to get a few things. And then once we get back to the house, your girl needs to put up that desk because baby never got it done, never did it. Need to do that. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So, your girl's in the academy now. Yeah. Lord have mercy, y'all. Oh, you don't want the regular basketball. You want something different. So, you don't want the orange basketball? Oh, they come in different sizes? I did not know basketballs was different sizes. This is a part of my hand up. Who got time for that, okay? Uh, 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 uh. 
Hey y'all. <laughs> y'all baby, it's been about two days since your girl didn't abandon y'all. And um, I say abandoned because y'all like literally, let's talk about how it's always something we got to talk about every time I get on the camera because it's like, babe, I be having, sometimes y'all, I don't even know what I be having going on, you know? But let me um sit y'all up so I can kind of get y'all a quick rundown before we get into, why my camera not sitting up? So boom, we finna stand up because I'm trying to give y'all productive vibes like we actually about to get something done today. I hope, actually, you know what? We are gonna get something done today. First of all, y'all, I got Chick-fil-A for lunch earlier and I put chlorophyll in it. Y'all can see it's green up here. I can't really tilt it too much cause I don't need my drink falling out, okay? Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I got Chick-fil-A earlier and oh look wait a minute. I'm told me I'm like, you know what when I put chlorophyll in water I'm not gonna lie y'all. It's drinkable like it don't really have no taste It just have like a metal like aftertaste if you've had chlorophyll in water Then you know what I'm talking about but I was like, you know what? Let me put some of my lemonade because quick little um story time It's not even a story time, but y'all I'll be watching my girl Keandria J I started checking my girl out because she entertaining Okay, if y'all don't watch Keandria J baby go watch her because she's entertaining. I love her but I remember Remember one of her blogs, she was talking about um, chlorophyll, and she was like, she um, does pineapple juice, and she put her chlorophyll in it. And I'm like, baby, I know, I know it's good because baby, it busts in that lemonade. So y'all, it is, it's 5:09. Your girl just got off work at five o'clock. Y'all, as soon as I got off work, baby, I clocked. Out, I baby, damn near clocked out at 4:59. Okay, y'all, I was so ready to get out of work today. I don't know what it was. Today was like, oh, it was like draining. I get out of work, I look at my dress, I look at my drawers, but I look everywhere. I go look in the kitchen, I'm looking everywhere, and I'm like, where is my camera at? I can't find my camera for nothing for Man in the Moon. Me, I'm getting ready to call Joseph. Like, have you seen my camera? I can't find my camera. With with whoop, baby, of course he doesn't answer the phone. So I'm still looking or whatever. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's literally always some air time. I want to block. It's something. I'm just continuing to look or whatever, right? And y'all, it's so funny because, um, I don't know if I told y'all this, but Joseph, he had let me use his AirPods. I ended up using them for like two days, y'all. I was at the house every time I used them AirPods. Like, I literally don't remember being nowhere else, right? So, come to find out, like, after I'm done using them, I'm thinking they still in my purse. Maybe the next day, or it was like a few days later, he was like, babe, you know where my AirPods at? I'm like, um, heavy my purse. Yeah, my purse. But when I tell you I got to dig into that purse, that AirPods wasn't even nowhere to be saw, to be thought about. Baby, I couldn't find them AirPods in nowhere in that purse. When I say I checked and cleaned every crevice and them AirPods was still in my A, I'm like, you know what? Like, maybe they're my other purse. Cause I, I'm just knowing in my head, baby, these AirPods is in some type of purse. So I get to dig in my other purse or whatever, baby, no AirPods. Yeah, I literally tore the house up trying to find these AirPods. Literally could not find them anywhere so i'm getting to the point where i'm like okay i'm gonna replace his airpods because in my head i'm like it's my fault because i know if it was me in that situation and he was using something of mine and he had a misplaced there whatever the case might be i know in a heartbeat he would have replaced it so at that rate i'm like okay if the airpods not found by the end of this week i'm going to replace them so the other day he got to the car wash um he tell me he like oh yeah i found my airpods i'm like oh my gosh like y'all it was just such a freaking relief and so now i'm not asking to use his airpods no more because baby i ain't gonna say i'm not asking to use them no more because i might but he don't really care like he be giving them to me he be like yeah like you know i don't care whatever but more of the story me telling y'all that i didn't lost my camera i lost my earphones i lost his airpods i lost my keys y'all i still yet i do not know where my keys are and i need to find them because maybe for one i have the key to i just finished paying my lease okay quick story time again y'all know how i told y'all i got a lease to do makeup right if you don't know the tea baby go back a couple vlogs and you're gonna find out the tea but long story short i ended up renting out a lease to do makeup and y'all know i left my mama house so i had to end my lease right so i just finished paying for my lease last week week before last i just finished paying for it right recently and so i have the key the key is still on my other keys i don't know where my keys are baby nowhere to be found and so here's this if i don't end up finding my keys then she's gonna have to get her locks changed y'all know ain't nothing in life free more of the story is baby i need the keys to come up so i didn't literally lost everything this week and last week it's so funny because my boyfriend was like Remind me not to give you nothing important. You'll lose your arm if it went attached to you. I'm like, ha, ha, ha. You must think you're funny. So, yeah, I just wanted to tell y'all that. Just tell y'all. But, anywho, yeah, work was dreading today. Now that I'm off work, I have a video that's going up at 6. I need to actually make a thumbnail for it. And that's literally all I got to do. So, I need to go do that now. And then, baby, y'all know what we finna do. Baby, let me tell y'all what we finna do. We finna go build that desk. 
Okay, that's what we finna go do. Originally, I wanted Joseph to build it and he wouldn't have minded. I keep moving my hair, y'all, because y'all know I don't really have my hair straight that much. And then y'all know your girl got some inches now. She got some little hang time now. So y'all know I just gotta swing and flip and whoop the dude before it start getting stiff. But anywho, so yeah, he would have definitely built that desk for me. I just came to think about it and I'm like, you know what? I actually wanna build it. Like, I actually wanna be Bob the Builder today. So that's exactly what we fixing to do. We gonna build that today because who say women can't be Bob the Builder too? We finna do that. I thought I'd do this thumbnail, but enough talking because baby, we need to get into something, okay? Besides just standing up, because what productiveness is that? Actually, y'all, I need to take a picture real quick so I can have some type of um thumbnail. <laughs> Let me get y'all where the lighting good. All of the a sudden, y'all. Let me sit down. Maybe I should just sit down. That's what I should do. Baby, one thing about this camera, if she gonna do something, she gonna fall. If she don't do nothing else, she gonna fall, okay? But y'all, all of the a sudden is like, one day I look up, I got 10 lip glosses. Next day I look up, I'm struggling to find one. But lately, for like the last past week and a half, that's what your girl been using. Now I ain't gonna lie, I do got one lip gloss roaming around here that I know of, but maybe can't find it right now, okay? So, let me, um, where my phone at? I just had, oh, okay. Hold on, y'all. Oh, boo, that picture is giving! Oh my gosh, y'all. I cannot, like, this picture is so pretty. It's just, why the sun hitting me like that, though? Y'all know that picture finna be in a thumbnail, okay? Boom, there she go. Oh, can't let y'all see so much. Boom, there she go. Boom, there she go. Boom, there she go! Baby, there she go. There she go, there she go, there she go. Okay, so, y'all. I wanted to be Bob the Builder so bad. Here we are, okay? So, the first thing that I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna start by separating these screws. We got bolt screws and tapping screws. So, the screw in the eccentric screw to the board, do not tighten it too tight. Or table legs for those, two side panels. Oh, this is so much, y'all. Just looking at it, like, it just seems like so much. When screwing the eccentric screw to the board, do not tighten it too tight. I'm confused already. Well, okay, let's go ahead and start separating stuff. So we got four table legs. Y'all, I'm starting to regret this already. Like, girl, you couldn't wait? No, I couldn't. By the way, y'all, I got my video up. It's, oh, I haven't even updated y'all, so. It's 7.42. I probably should have waited. Y'all think I should wait? No, nah, we've already done damage. Might as well keep going, right? Oh, what am I, a construction worker? Um, I guess we can start with boat number. Oh, this seems simple. See, it's the 25. Okay, this seems pretty simple, y'all. Okay, boom. All you have to do is look at the numbers and letters. If I had known that, I would have been, uh, duh. Y'all, I think this is honestly simpler than what I'm making it. Let's get into it, okay? This is definitely a two-person job, so when I accomplish it, I need a round of applause. They say righty tighty, lefty loosey. I think that's what the people be saying. Am I going left or right? Okay. Y'all, I freaking did it. Ugh, go me. Oh no, it's turned the wrong way. Y'all, I did it. Oh my gosh, look how far I got. Y'all should be so proud of me. Like, girl, is you proud or what? Is y'all proud or what? Baby, I'm not digging the lighting, so I think I'm gonna re-angle y'all. Okay, is that better? Yes, that is so much better. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I am good at this. Like, I know this is my first time building something, y'all, but I'm good at this, okay? Who y'all know? I'm here building stuff, okay? Nobody. Wait, where the other hole is? Oh, wrong part. <laughs> Girl, look how far I didn't come, y'all. Oh, look how far I came. Y'all, this is kind of therapeutic. All you gotta do is read, read, and it's very fundamental. That's all. Oh, I'm gonna find myself out, okay. See, y'all, I'm gonna accomplish this because I'm persistent, okay? I'm not gonna give up. I don't give up too easily. This is definitely a two-person job, but I just want to be so hard about it and try to do it all by myself. Oh my gosh, go me. Y'all, who do y'all know that's out here building stuff? Who y'all know? Oh, that's Slim. Okay, I'm not going to talk until I get done. Clearly, I'm doing too much talking right now because every time I get to talking about myself, I get stuck again. Okay, these is tight. They shouldn't move or go nowhere. I think you're doing good, honestly, if you ask me. Baby, baby, baby. From the day I saw you, I really, really want to catch your eye. There's something special about you, and I must really like you. Cause not a lot of guys are worth my time. Oh, Ooh, baby, 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 it's getting kind of crazy. Cause you are taking over my
okay. One and two. Now, let me show y'all what the next step is. So, I gotta take this little long part. Y'all see that, the little long part? Okay, these are the two I already made. I gotta take that little long part and just put it in between both of them. Y'all know what I'm saying. That is, oh, so what am I gonna put? Okay, you know what, worry about one thing at a time. Oh, that's gonna be simple. Oh, simple. So yeah, we're gonna take this long part and, you know, put it between both of them. Good morning, y'all. It's a new day. It's currently about 7.28 in the morning. 7.29 now. When I got up, it was like 6.52. I just sat in the bed for a little bit, you know, browsed the internet, of course. And then I got up, brushed my teeth, washed my face, did all that. And I was listening to E.T. this morning. But now, oh, I never showed y'all last night. <clears throat> Baby, your girl needed help last night, okay? I did not end up finishing it. But y'all know Joseph came through for me like he always do. I couldn't, I finished everything. I'm about to go show y'all. But I finished everything. Your girl could not get that top part on like I could not get the countertop part on for nothing okay but he ended up helping me so he ended up getting it on cuz your girl was just done with it but um I didn't made up the bed this morning cuz I told you I don't know if I told y'all like I started this habit a while ago making up the bed it does really and truly make you have a more productive day like I told y'all it is 7 30 and I need to call Apple support because I need to see if they can help me with my hard drive because she's not reading like why not and I have a video on there that actually well not the next video y'all gonna see because clearly um i'm filming right now so when this is up the video gonna been have been out hopefully but i need to get a video up i uploaded yesterday i need to get another video up sunday today is thursday i need to get another video no today is friday i need to get another video up by sunday so that's the plan and then yeah so i need to call apple support and then i need to call cola fitness because they've been charging my car and i don't even work out there no more because i don't live in the area where the gym was located because it wasn't a gym where like y'all know how it's a place Planet Fitness just about anywhere. It's a um, 24 hour fitness anywhere. Call out, it was a specific gym. It wasn't a gym that's like in other surrounding cities. So I need to cancel my membership. And I don't think they're gonna charge a girl none because I didn't been there over a year. Because I know you have to be there for at least a certain amount of time in order to cancel membership. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cancel that. So I need to call Apple Support. I need to call Cola Fitness. And then you girl gonna fix up some breakfast because, um, yeah, I want an omelet this morning. What's new? I'm always eating an omelet. But I think I'm gonna fix an omelet and I'm gonna fix some grits because I don't got everything that I usually will put in my omelet. So yeah, I'm gonna fix some grits on the side with that and yeah let's just get into the day okay i got work today y'all of course what's new 10 to 5 so i wanted to show y'all this desk um now i do think that so here's the desk i ended up finished building it like i told y'all just to put this part on last night because i couldn't do it but i love how sleek this is like i love that y'all i need to take my hair down but i'm not taking it down to after i cook because i don't like my hair being down when i cook y'all i caught them yesterday but it was literally like 10 50 some almost 11 o'clock and they closed at 10 p.m i was like oh how can I help you today? Final Cut Pro support. Technical support. Okay, I'll get you right over to our technical support department. Could I be transferred to Final Cut Pro department? Michaela McLeod. She sound like me when I be on the phone in the morning. <laughs> I'm dead. Baby, I know you probably just clocked in at 7 30. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, 8 o'clock. Uh, uh, probably a lot of times at 10 not gonna go back to sleep because I gotta be on the phone with them I don't know how long it's gonna take then I got the call call out I don't even know what the process is to end my membership because they want you to do so much to end a membership child they want you to go the extra mile and do so many things y'all I need to find my keys like oh lord okay thank you so much Y'all, I need to find my keys. Like, I have no idea where the freak my keys could be. Literally don't know. That's gonna be something I'm gonna have to get done today, y'all. I need to find my keys. Like, literally, if I have to look through everything in that closet, look through everything in them drawers, maybe I'm going to look through it because I need to find them keys. Seriously. Um, 
Y'all, so how about I probably like 20 minutes ago cried my eyes out. <laughs> I went and fixed me some breakfast. I made me an omelet and I made me some grits. I should have put shrimp in my grits, but y'all, I didn't think about it till I was like, dang, I forgot we had shrimp in there. I could have put some shrimp in my grits, but you know what? It's cool. I'm not complaining because this omelet and grits gonna do just fine, okay? The only difference is my omelet don't have no cheese on it, so it's a little dry, but it's still good. But many updates, y'all, because I'm really, it's, um, it's not. 18. I'm about to watch Bel Air until I got a clock in at 10. But um, I called Apple Support, y'all. They couldn't do nothing for me. And when I got to phone with them, I cried my eyes out. I cried because I mean, I was sad at the fact that I lost a video because I did. You know, I lost one of my videos that I wanted to upload. It, it was the video where I posted on Instagram and I asked y'all to ask me questions because I was going to do like a Q&A within that video. Yeah, I was going to do like a Q&A in that video and then also, it was like a vlog and I did a Q&A in that vlog like uh, ask me questions advice you know self-care little portion for the girlies right that video it, it i'm not gonna say it's gone because i gotta call these other people they don't open to eight o'clock pacific time which will be 10 o'clock my time and i'll be on the clock so i really can't call them to lunch but or maybe it might not work. I don't know yet. But long story short y'all i cried my eyes out because i lost the video that was partially a why i cried I was upset. I hate when people be like, oh, you crying over that? Or you too grown to cry and whoop, whoop, whoop. Y'all, crying is not always a bad thing. Sometimes I cry as a releasement, as a form of releasement. Because what I don't want to do is sit up and be angry all day about that one thing. You know what I'm saying? Now that I didn't cry that hurt out and I've meditated and I've moved past it and I'm just accepting the fact that maybe that wasn't a video that was meant to go up. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I'm understanding. I'm like, you know what? Maybe that video just was not meant to go up yeah that's that the main reason why i was crying though was because i use an external hard drive to store stuff on because my computer of course don't have enough storage because yeah i make like 20 to 40 sometimes hour long videos so a computer is not going to store that of course the company that i got my external hard drive from i've had problems with this company like more times than a few y'all but i'm about to watch Bel Air, and your girl is about to finish eating okay i don't know when i'm gonna holler y'all i don't know when i'm gonna holler y'all probably sometime when i um either when i get off of work because i'm a cook when i get off i want to make like some chicken breasts and i want to um put them in like an alfredo sauce i told y'all i want to do that and one of these vlogs i told y'all i'm going to do that because i got the ingredients too so that's something that I want to do in there. What else do I want to do? I don't know. I know I want to cook today. That's it. That's literally all I know. Oh, y'all. I called Call Out Fitness and they sent me an email to do my cancellation. Girl, I don't have to pay a fee because y'all don't know, baby. Y'all used to see me work out so much. I have been at the gym well over a year. So that's all I said. So the only thing on my agenda really is calling to figure out what I'm going to do with this external hard drive. I might have to send it back to Western Digital, but if I have to, they're going to do one of two things. They're going to send me a different hard drive. I'm talking about not even this brand. I don't I don't want this kind of hard drive no more because my thing is why am I having so many issues out of this? And y'all's warranty, it says three to five years. It's literally been two and a half years Years and I'm having the most issues out of this. I had issues before I even hit a year having it. They're either gonna do that or they're gonna run my money back. Point blank, period. Bottom line. Because ain't nobody got time. For ain't nobody got time for that. And it makes it even worse, y'all, when I ask fellow YouTubers that I know who have external hard drives, have they had the type of issues out their hard drive that I've been having out of mine? And they tell me no. It kind of pisses me off even more because it's like, okay. I got the bad one out the box. You know, I got the bad one out the bunch. So, yeah, y'all gonna bad one me my money back or y'all gonna bad one me another one. Okay, period. Bottom line. Hey, y'all. It's y'all, babe, back in the cut. <laughs> this vlog specifically, babe. This this one right here. I know she done been all over the place. But y'all, I'm up. I'm trying on outfits because, baby, y'all know we finna get back into it. I got this shirt on that I showed y'all that a brand sent me. And then I got these pants on. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna wear them high-waisted. Let me show y'all. Let me know if I'm gonna wear the pants. I know I'm not gonna wear no belt. So, I'm gonna be pulling them up because, baby, y'all know your girl ain't got no waist. So, I don't know if I'm gonna wear the pants like this or if I'm gonna let them you know, be at the waistline and wear them like this. But what I do know is, um, as far as a, I'm gonna wear a heel with this. I wanna do like a strap, like a strap around like my jeans. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Like the heels that strap up around your jeans. I'm thinking that's gonna be the vibe for this outfit. Basically, I just wanted to be given like a 90s cartoon type of vibe. Y'all know what I mean? A fit really ain't a fit without the shades. You know, that don't really, you know, the fit ain't complete without the shades. So I got these four that I'm debating on. Yeah. 